I do give honor to God, to our pastor, Pastor Pierce, and to all the saints of God, each and every one of you. We thank God for the choir and that good song that was sung, the praise team, amen. Every song and every testimony that went up for the glory and honor of him, we thank the Lord for it. Amen. God is a good God. Amen. How many of you know God is good? Amen. Amen. No, matter, no matter what's going on in your life, God is still good. Is that right? Yeah. Hallelujah. Thank you. No matter even how you feel, God is still good. Yes. Hallelujah. Sometimes we feel, sometimes we don't feel good. Sometimes we, sometimes we don't feel encouraged. Amen. But it's not by the feeling, it's by faith. Amen. Amen. So we want to thank the Lord, amen, for one more Sunday that he blessed us to get together one more time, one more service, amen. Yeah. Amen, because somebody that was here last night is gone on into eternity. Mm -hmm. Amen, but the Lord has spared us one more time mm -hmm. and given us the ability to come into the house of the Lord. Mm -hmm. And I truly appreciate God for that. I want to thank God. You know, it's God that has kept you. It's God that has kept you well and healthy, has brought you this far and brought us this far. It's only the Lord, like Caleb said, it's the Lord that kept me alive. Amen. Shoot, truly, it's God that has kept us alive. Amen. For a reason and a purpose. Uh, amen. Praise God. He kept us alive for his glory. Amen. And then others that are not saved, he kept you alive. Praise God to give you another opportunity to give your heart to Christ. Hallelujah. I just want to thank the Lord for his goodness. I give honor to our overseer, Apostle Mary, Lady Danielle Murray, Dr. Shirley Murray, and to our pastor, Pastor Pierce, and thank God for him allowing us to go forth in the Lord. Amen. You know, some, some churches, they won't let the women want to do anything, but Amen. we want to thank the Lord to our Amen. pastor. He allows us to have our women program and allows us to, to conduct and to sing and to do what we need to do. So we want to just thank the Lord for that. Amen. Just want to thank God for how he come into my life. Praise God. 40, been to be 47 years ago, saved me, sanctified me, and filled me with the Holy Ghost. Yeah. You know, when I got saved, the devil said I wouldn't even last two weeks. Mm -hmm. Amen. And sometimes I would find myself crying out to God and we just act hysterical. Mm -hmm. Lord, don't let me go back. Don't let me back fly. Amen. Then know that the Lord is the keeper. Yes, yes. Amen. I ain't got to worry about a thing. Just keep my eyes on him. Hallelujah. Amen. And I just want to thank God that I don't have to feel like that anymore. I don't have to be afraid that I might backslide and go back out there. Amen. Amen. But I, I, I know that God is my keeper. He's a shepherd. Yes, and he has kept us this far. And I give him the glory and honor for all things he's done for us. Yes. Amen. I want to thank God. Praise yes. the Lord. Amen. For this opportunity, and ask you all to pray for me that the Lord would have his way in his little sermon that he's given me. I had something else, but the Lord kept giving me with this one. That's all Amen. right. Amen. Praise God. I, I, I just learned to obey the Lord. When the Lord give you a message is in the house, somebody needed it. Amen. Yeah. Praise God. So I just want to be obey the Lord and try to say everything he would have me to say. Because yeah. if I say what I want to say, it ain't going to be out there hill of beans. Yeah. But if I say what he wants, he said, amen, God can do a work in our hearts, amen. amen. How many want the Lord to do a work in your heart? Amen. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Amen. Let us turn to Genesis, the sixth chapter, and the fifth verse. Praise God. We're going to be coming from Genesis, and we're going to be also in the New Testament as well. Praise God, hallelujah. Amen. Just want the Lord just to have his way. Praise God. We do believe in reading the word of God. Hallelujah. We may not read every scripture, but we like to read our main text. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Genesis, the sixth chapter and the fifth verse. Let me know when you have it. Amen. Genesis 6 and 5. And God saw that the wickedness of man was great in the earth and that every imagination of the thoughts of his heart was only evil continuously. Isn't that the time we're living in? Yeah. Amen. Amen. And it repented the Lord that he had made man on, he had made man on the earth and he grieved him at his heart. And the Lord said, I will destroy man whom I have created from the face of the earth, both man and beast and creeping thing and the fowl of the air. But it repents me that I have made them. But Noah found grace in the eyes of the Lord. Mm -hmm. These are the generation of Noah. Noah was a just man and perfect in his generation. And Noah walked with God. Can you say that you walk with God? Amen. And Noah walked with God. 
Hallelujah. Even in the midst of all that sin, I mean, sin was everywhere. God said there was so much sin everywhere. But God found one man yes. and his family that was different than all the other folks Amen. in the world. Amen. 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 Praise God. Some people don't want to be different. They want to blend in. They want to blend in with the world. Amen. They don't want to be different. But Noah stood out. Amen. Everybody knew Noah served Jehovah. Amen. Amen. The rest of them had turned their backs on Jehovah. Amen. Now, there were some that said they were still serving Jehovah, but they were serving all other kind of gods, too, and they still said they had the Lord. Mm -hmm. Amen. But, but, but Noah, he, he walked with the Lord only. Amen. He, he served. He was true to his God, Jehovah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And, and, and he found favor in the eyes of the Lord. Amen. When the Lord looked down on the earth, full of sin. Amen. Go up and down the highway, all the billboards are just wickedness. Wickedness. Amen. They were talking about it in the newspaper how they had closed down a, 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 a new bar. I said, Lord, I ain't no new, new bar in Dallas. I said, Lord, that's a shame. My God, hallelujah. How wicked can you get? Topless bra, uh, uh, bar. All kind of things going on. Amen. The wickedness of the nations. The wickedness in the cities. Amen. Praise God. It, we would, you would be a shock to find out what all things are going on. But God sees it. God yeah. sees everything yeah. people are doing. Yeah. And God looked down at, 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 at Noah's time, and all they, they were inventing something wicked to do. Mm -hmm. They kept in, making up new things they could do. Some, some type of wickedness. That's what we have today. We have all kind of wickedness. You can, you, it's so easy to do wicked. It's so icky. The devil keep presenting it to you. You be on that trying to surf the, the web to try to look at the news. Here comes something new on that. Here comes something wicked. Amen. Praise God. But amen. We have to have a mind to turn our heads and keep on a, uh, don't look at such things as that. Amen. Praise God. It takes the power of God to turn your head. Yeah. It takes the power of God to live holy. Yeah. But you know that's a miracle. If you, if you was a sinner and now you can live holy, now you can turn your head to things you used to do. Now you can, you, you, you don't even want those wicked things anymore. That's a miracle that God has brought forth in your life. Amen. That is a miracle. Yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. That's no, that's no light thing. Yeah. Hallelujah. To live a saved life in this time and an hour, that's a miracle. Yeah. To have a mind to want to come to church. To have a mind to want to hear the true word of God. Amen. That's a miracle. Yeah. A miracle. Amen. Because the natural man, the human side of man, the, the carnal man, he, he wants wickedness. He wants more wickedness. He, he can't get enough wickedness. Mm -hmm. Amen. He, can't get, he just can't get tired of the wickedness. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Praise God. The way we were be, before the Lord came in and changed us Amen. and gave us a new heart and a new mind. Mm -hmm. Praise God. So Lord, God was looking on his creation and it brought it grieved God to yeah. his heart when he looked yeah. on what he had created and how how now they have all turned their backs on God. They have all stopped serving God. Stopped just about all of them except one man and his family that was still holding up the blood-stained banner. Amen. Noah, a man of God, a preacher of righteousness, preached the word of God in his day. He didn't have but a amen. Praise God. He didn't have but a few members. Hallelujah. Him and his wife, his three sons and three daughters-in-law. Those are all the ones that would come. And they would listen to Noah preach the word and, and, and would take heed to the word of the Lord. Amen. Amen. He tried to reach many others. Yeah. Tried to tell them to come on and get in the ark mm -hmm. that you may be saved. Mm -hmm. But they laughed and was gone. They said, you don't have to live like that today. But you know, I'm serving Jehovah too. And I'm still, and I'm still, I ain't got to get in that old ark with all the animals and stuff. Amen. Praise God. Made fun of the Lord. They made fun of him. Because it didn't make sense of him. Because he'd make it a big old ship out there on the dry ground. And plus, it ain't never rained before. What? Yeah. He, he is crazy. That's what they were saying. He's crazy. Yeah. And they look at us and say, oh, she just lost her mind. Yeah, I sure did lose my mind. I lost, I lost the mind of the world. Now yeah. I have a mind. Yeah. The mind of Christ. Yeah. Amen. 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 Oh, she just done went crazy. Huh? They done brainwashed her. Oh, I, my brain needed washing. My brain was dirty. It needed washing. I thank yeah. God. It was, they Lord washed me with the blood of Amen. 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 God washed my mind. Yes. My mind was just yes. God. In Noah's day, only evil contingency. Yeah. Only evil contingency. Yeah. Praise the Lord. We had, we had a taste of evil back then when we yeah. was out there. We had a taste of the wicked thing. Mm -hmm. We had a taste. Amen. But anything wrong, it, it interests us. 
Amen. But I want to thank the Lord yes, because amen. the Lord came in one day. Yes, he amen. Did. He said, if any man be in Christ, yes. if any woman be in Christ, yes. he is a new creature. All things are passed away. Behold, all things are become new. Yes. I want you to know that one day when I met Jesus, hallelujah, he gave me a brand new heart, a brand new mind. He gave me a brand new life, yes. a brand new way of thinking, a brand new way of looking at things, a brand new desire. A holy desire, a holy ambition. Hallelujah. My ambition now is a holy ambition. Whatever we do now, we want to do it for the glory of him. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory. Ain't God good? Yes. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. We just thank God. See, the weakness of man, it grieved God to his heart. And I want you to know, God is grieved to his heart today as he was in the days of Noah. Amen. Praise God. He's yet grieved. Amen. And the Bible has said, the Bible, Jesus was, gave a parable about the, uh, the virgin, the ten virgins, amen. Five of them was wise and five was foolish. Yeah. Amen. The, the wise one, they was, amen, they were trying to do everything that the Lord would have them to do. Amen. amen. They made sure that the vessels was full of oil. Yeah. They made sure that the light was shining bright. Hallelujah. They were trying to do everything that the master that God would have them to do. They was willing and obedient. Amen. And they were just waiting for the bridegroom to come. They were waiting on the bridegroom. And we have a bridegroom that's going to come. Yeah. Amen. We have Jesus. He's our bridegroom. We are his bride. The church is the bride of Christ. We have a bride, amen, a, 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 a bridegroom that we're waiting on. And that's what they were doing. They were waiting on the bridegroom to come. Yeah. Amen. And they kept their life right. They kept their vessel full of oil. Yes. Amen. That oil is a typical figure of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Amen. Do you have the Holy Ghost today? Amen. Amen. Is the Holy Ghost in your vessel today? Amen. 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 Is your light shining today? Oh, amen. Glory to God. Amen. The five wise ones, amen, they, was, they, they just kept looking for the bridegroom. Amen. They didn't have time for this foolish stuff that's going on out, out in the world. Amen. But the five foolish ones, oh, they say, oh, it don't take all that. All it takes is a little bit of oil. It's a teeny weeny bit of oil. Amen. So they, they didn't keep their vessels filled with oil. Amen. They, they didn't keep watch for the bridegroom. They were doing other things. Amen. Amen. They fell asleep. Amen. Praise God. And when the bridegroom came, yeah. they, they tried to turn their lamps on it, and they had no oil in the lamp. Come on they down. had no light, amen. They could not go out and meet the bridegroom when he came. But the five wives, they went out to meet him, and they went in to the wedding supper, amen, with the, with, with the bridegroom. Okay, and then the five foolish ones, oh, they began to try to find some oil. So they had to go to the store and buy some oil to put in their vessels. And then they came to the door and knocked on the door. And the master came to the door. And the master said, who are you? Mm. Hallelujah. I don't know you. Hallelujah. And he said, the door is shut. Yeah. Amen. Amen. My little subject on today is when God shut the door. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I said, when God shut the door. Yeah. Amen. So they came and knocked on the door. But God had already shut the door. Yeah. It was too late. Yeah. Amen. Praise God when God Amen. shut the door. So uh, Noah, he was, he was out there building the ark. And as he was building the ark, he was preaching. He was trying to tell them, if you want to be saved, come into the ark. Amen. Because it's going to rain. It's going to rain. Amen. And, but they said it ain't never rained before. Uh -huh. They said my grandma said it was going to rain. Yeah. My great, 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 great grandpa said it was going to rain. Yeah. It ain't rain yet. But Noah just kept on preaching. He kept on building on the ark. And they made fun of Noah there. You know, sometimes when you're standing up for the truth, people make fun of you yeah, now. They oh, they, so they old folk. Don't you know they don't take all that no more? Amen. Praise God. Because why well, they're being deceived. Amen. Amen. In Noah's day, I mean, they was being deceived. Someone thought they was thought they were serving Jehovah and they were serving all other kind of gods as well. Amen. But I want you to know you can't serve but one God. One Amen. God. God, God, God said you should have no other God before me. Amen. I'm the only one. You can't serve me and the devil too. You can't yes. worship God and, and glorify the devil too. Amen. You got to choose what 
which, which one you going to serve? Amen. amen. Praise God. When God shut the door. Amen. Hallelujah. So, amen. Let's go on now and look at Genesis, the, uh, the seventh chapter and the thirteenth. We're going to read that right quick. Hallelujah. Glory to God. When God shut the door. Hallelujah. When, you know, Jesus said, I, I close doors that no man can open. Hallelujah. And he can open doors that no man can close. How would you know when God shut the door? Can no man open a door that God closes? Amen. Amen. When God, amen, said it's over, it is over. No matter what man can do. Amen. Praise God. I don't know. Amen. God is good. Amen. Amen. I just want to go right on. We're going to read that seven. Genesis 7 and 13. Oh, glory. Do you have it? Amen. Genesis 7 and 13. Amen. And in the self same day, in it, Noah, Shem, Ham, and Japheth, and the sons of Noah, and Noah's wife, and three, and three, and the three wives of the sons, they went with them into the ark. That was that was our total congregation. I think we got more of you than, than what Noah had. Amen. That was his total church. Amen. Hallelujah. Would nobody else want to come in and be saved? But amen. Thank God his three sons and his daughter, their, daughter, their wives, they believed. And so they came on into the Lord. Yeah. Amen. The 14th verse said, And they and every beast after its kind and all the cattle after their kind, every creeping thing that creepers above the earth after his kind, every fowl after his kind, every bird and of every sort. sort. And they went into the ark, into the they went unto Noah into the ark, two by two, of all flesh, wherein is the breath of life. Amen. They went in, male and female, all flesh. And, and God commanded him, as God commanded him, and the, and, and the Lord shut the door. Yeah. Amen. Did you say that? Yeah. And the, the Lord Lord's shut him in. Amen. Amen. Noah didn't close the door. Uh -uh. Amen. Amen. When all the animals, the animals had enough sense to come into the ark. Amen. They said there was a tsunami in Indonesia, and they said all the animals started going to the high ground. But but the people they were out on the beach, lay out there committing adultery, fornication, or whatever else. Amen. Lay out there, calling themselves having a good time, and the animals were going up to high ground. Amen. Right. Praise God. The animal had enough sense to get out of that corn place. Yeah. Hallelujah. He didn't. Right. No one had to go out there and chase them things, made them go in there. They just came in there. And two by two, obedient to God. God said, come on, and they just come. They just obey the Lord. Lord go with God said, do. Amen. God tell man to come on. Oh, no, I ain't going that way. I'm going to lay over here. God said, come this way. No, I'm going to do my thing. Amen. But then they, 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 they obeyed and just came in there. He didn't have to go out there and hunt for them and, and dig for them and run and chase them down. They, they just obeyed to obey the Lord. Amen. Amen. The animal had enough sense to obey the Lord, but the but men, no, 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 no. They laughed. And they, they should have known something was happening with them animals were doing that. Amen. Hallelujah. But they kept on in their sins. Good. Amen. Praise God. The 17th verse says, And the flood was 40 days upon the earth, and the waters increased and bear up the ark, and it was lifted up above the earth. And the waters prevailed and was increased greatly upon the earth, and the ark went upon the face of the waters. And the waters prevailed exceedingly upon the earth. All, all the high hills, you know, they tried, to, they tried to climb up to the highest hill. Amen. But the water covered all the highest hills, and all the highest mountains there were. The water covered them. Amen. And that was, and they was under the whole earth that was covered, the whole earth. Fifteen cubits up, upward did the water prevail. And the mountains, even the mountains was covered. They, they ran through the mountains, trying to get to the highest mountain to get safe, to be saved. But, when, but the water even covered the highest mountain. My Hallelujah. God. Amen. The, in other words, the highest skyscraper. Mm -hmm. Amen. God, amen, praise God. When he said, amen, that the water was going to prevail, it prevailed. Mm -hmm. Amen. And all, it said, 21st verse, said, all flesh died that moved upon the earth. Both of the fowls and of the cattle, of the beasts, and of every creeping thing that creeps upon the earth, and every man, all in whose nostril was the breath of life, all that was in dry land died. Okay. Amen. Oh, somebody tell you, that, oh, the Lord wouldn't do such a thing, honey. God loves you. God wouldn't do, put you in hell. God don't care what you do. That's a lie from the pit of hell. He already done it once. Destroyed the whole world and said, Eight people. Yes, he did. I mean, he's already done it once. Amen. Oh, Amen. hallelujah. But they want to 
believe the lie. Amen. Everything died. Amen. That's how much God hates sin. Amen. They had corrupted themselves. They had done evil. Amen. They had corrupted their mind. You know what God said? I will destroy man. Yeah. And he preserved a righteous seed. God always going to have a people. Amen. Amen. God's going to always have a people that's going to live right. Yeah. Amen. Praise God. There may be a whole lot of others that ain't living right, but God's going to always have them some people yeah. that's going to live right. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Praise God. And if God got to save everybody, I mean, if everybody died and go to hell, some eight people, wouldn't that be terrible? Mm -hmm. I'm going to be one of them eight. <laughs> Amen. 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 Amen
a, a lot of folks he hadn't witnessed to, nor had prayed and witnessed to. I believe they came out of that door. Oh, Noah, please open the door. I believe now. I believe. I see what you're talking about. I see what you're talking about. Open the door, door. Open the door, door. Hallelujah. And God know no heart was going to be so touchy in there that he was probably going to try to open the door. But God said, I'm going to fix this thing. I, I'm going to close the door. And once God closed the door, he said, I closed the door that no man can open. I shut doors that no man can open. Amen. They came and was beat on it. You don't want to think about it. Your mother may love you, but she can't open that door. Right. Yes, Amen. Yes. Oh, yes. I think I he loved his friends. And some of his relatives came to that door. He would have opened that door, but he didn't close the door. God closed the door. I want you to know, amen, praise God, even at that funeral, and it was a lot of folks there. Amen, praise God. And everybody went and we felt it together with the big family. You know how it is. It's like, like a family reunion when somebody died. All the family and cousins, they come together. We hugged one another, hadn't seen another in a long time. And I know that young man, he was just acting so nice. And, and my daughter said, well, Mama, I just, that's my first time meeting him. He's so sweet. Hey, that, that's, that's, that's Joe Lewis, son. Amen. Uh -huh. Amen. He was so sweet. And then on the way home, uh -huh. on the way home, we know why we was all going home. And we didn't think nothing. And on the way home, that young man, amen, something happened. It, went, it fell over. While he was driving, he, was, he just went out and lost control of the car. And he did not make it home. Then I thought to myself, I wonder what side of the door was he on? Yeah. Was he on the, the inside or outside? Amen? Yeah. That's going to be an important question to all of us. Yeah. Jesus don't have to come back for the door to close. Yeah. The door closed that day when he, when he crossed over. Once you die, the door is going to be closed. Either it may close, if you go to hell, that, there's just one door to hell and no, one way in and no way out. What side of the door are you going to be in? Are you going to be on that side of, in the hell fire, or are you going to be in the heavenly bliss with Jesus forever and ever? Thank you. Amen. That's something to think about. Yeah. That young man had no idea that was his last day on earth. He had no idea. He thought he was young, healthy, beautiful young man. Yeah. He had many years ahead of him. Little bitty, he had little bitty kids at home. Beautiful. He, had a, he, he was, but the door shut. Mm -hmm. But I knew in all my heart he was on, that, he was on the good side. He's on God's side. I sure do believe that. Amen? Amen. Praise God, but it's up to you. What's, what side of the door you going to be on when it closes? Amen. Amen. You don't have to, you ain't got to wait Jesus come back for the close. They can close today. Mm -hmm. you, you can be on, you, you, can, you can just go, you ain't got to be doing nothing to stand in there either. Just, just, just die. You got to be sick. Okay. I'm, 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 I'm strong. I got many years ahead of me. That's what the devil wants you to believe. That's what the devil wants you to believe, that you got many years ahead of you, you got plenty of time to get it right. Once I get 50, I'm gonna, I think I'm going to serve the Lord. Who said you're going to get 50? Amen. 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 Who said you even have a mind to serve God later on? You might, not, you might not ever have another mind to serve the Lord, ever. Amen. 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 You might not ever go tell God when you're coming in. Not on your terms. Mm -hmm. Amen. Like that rich young ruler, he wanted to come in. He wanted an eternal life. He said, what must I do to have an eternal life? He wanted to come on his own terms. He wants to say, I already kept the commandment. And when Jesus told him what to do, he didn't want to do it. Jesus told him to sell what you got. Sell, give up everything. That's what Jesus is telling you today. Give up everything. Amen. You want me? Give up everything. Amen. Everything. Amen. Jesus told him to sell everything you got and, and give to the poor and come and follow me. Yeah. But he thought that was too much. He thought that was too much to give up. Come on, girl. Somebody think it's too much to give up. I'm young. I'm strong. I got a life ahead of me. My, 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 my. You don't know what, 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 what you got. You don't know what, what, what kind of trap the devil got set for you. You don't know what. No, you don't. No, you don't. Once that door closes, honey, it ain't coming back open. Amen. Either you're going to be on the inside with the awful Savior with Jesus, or you're going to be on the outside with the devil, because the devil's going to burn in the fire too. Yeah. Amen. That same devil that's telling you to do all these things, that's telling you, don't listen to her. You got plenty of time. Yeah, he even told many of people that same thing. Mm -hmm. But the door didn't close on them. Mm -hmm. And they in there, wherever they was, you're going to die just like you are. You're not going to, you ain't going to die no sin and all of a sudden you got wings and you're an angel. The devil is a liar. Amen. If you die a sinner, you're going to be a sinner when you wake up. Yeah. 
When you open your eyes, wherever you are, you going to be a sinner or you going to be a Christian? Yeah. It's up to you. Amen. Amen. What side of the door are you on this morning? Amen. Amen. If you should die today, what side of that door is you on? That's the question. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. And Jesus said, come unto me. Yeah. Amen. That's all we can do is preach the gospel. Amen. All we can do is tell you, you can't make you do it. Amen. Just like you can take the horse to the trunk and try to make him drink some water. He don't want to drink none. He ain't going to drink none. Right. I can try to make you drink some. You ain't going to drink it. You got to walk this time. Amen. 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 But I'm just so glad. Amen. Praise God that I'm on the inside. How many of y'all are on the inside right now? Amen. Inside the ark. We inside. Jesus is that ark. Yeah. That's a typical thing of Jesus. Jesus is that ark. Yes. Okay? Amen. Jesus is that ark. He said, I am the door. Uh -huh. Any man come by me, he must be saved. Amen. He said, I'm the door to the chief court. I'm the door to heaven. I'm the doorway. I, he said, I'm the way, the truth, and the life. There's no other way but Jesus Christ. Amen. There's no other way. But through Christ Jesus, he said, I am the way. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. But somebody, some folk rather just go ahead and take their chances out there. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Slip on a slippery slope. Amen. You're on a slippery slope. And your feet are going to slip in due time. Mm -hmm. Out there. I thank God the Lord saved me for my, for my feet slipped. Amen. I was just about there. I was just about to slide into hell. But thank God. The door opened, and I, you know what I did? The door opened, and Jesus said, come to me. You know what I did? I went on in. Yeah, Amen. And now Amen. I'm saved. Amen. Now I'm saved in my Saved in his arms. Yeah. I am saved. Yeah. As long as I stay in Christ, I'm saved yeah. from all hurt, harm, and danger. Amen. Praise God. Amen. Hallelujah. You know what? You know the Bible, what the Bible says? Set your affection on things above, not on things of the earth. Amen. So if there anybody want to get on the right side of that door this, this morning, amen, that's all tonight. Maybe that's somebody who want to get in, get into the ark and to stay in the ark. Amen. 